Hey everyone, it's Linda. Thanks so much for joining my channel today and watching this video. Um, first off, to all my subscribers, thank you so much, new and old subscribers. You can't imagine how much I appreciate you watching my videos and taking time to comment. Okay, I thought I heard something. I'm at work, just so you know. So anyway, here's the deal. Long story short, my air conditioner went out in the house on Saturday. It's been in the 90s, feeling like 100s here. I had to move my craft room into my bedroom, put a window unit in my bedroom. And uh, I basically just finished that last night at around 9.30, almost 10 o'clock. So if you haven't seen a video from me, that's why. Second off, if you can, and I'm not really asking for much, but please say a prayer for me and my family right now. Um, we are having such a hard time trying to find and get into a new place. I don't know why everything has to be so difficult. Um, you know, I'm going to meet with somebody today after work to hopefully, hopefully, hopefully get things rolling on a new place. And it's been needed for a long time. But as I said, it's so hard, um, you know, when you have a budget and everything else. But anyway, I'm not going to go on that tangent. But if you pray, please say a prayer for us that we find and get into a new place. You know, hopefully within the next month or two because we really need it so bad. And now that the air condition's out, it's so much more of a necessity. As I said, we are renting an, a, a very old house. This air conditioning unit is probably, I can't even tell you how old it is. Um, but yeah, the landlord doesn't want to fix anything. He wants to sell the house, but um, we need to downsize. I, it's just one of those things you can't keep, you know, there's too much wrong with it. I wouldn't buy it. Knowing all, all this stuff, I would have to even try to fix as well as remodeling. I don't have it in me. I don't have the budget for that. And he pretty much knew that. I told him that. So, anyway, he's mad. He hasn't bothered fixing anything because he wants to sell the house. So he's just pretty much waiting for us to move out so he can try to sell the house. That being said. Anyway. So I put a window unit in my bedroom, as I said. And I have been moving my things in there. Just finished last night. It's late. I'm hoping I'll get all my friend mails sent out within the next week. I'm sorry if, if, if it's late or not in a timely manner. I do apologize to anybody who's waiting on mail from me. I'm sorry. Anyway, um, I also have not had a day off of work this week. I do have Sunday off next week. I don't, I have one day off again. I've been going to, I've been having one day off a week for I don't know how long now. So, um, yeah, just bear with me. I I won't be doing as many hauls as normal. I will be throwing in hauls here and there when I do go. However, all of my money... <laughs> believe it or not, is going into this. This is my... When I want to go spend money, instead I've been throwing it into my bucket <laughs> to save money to help with payment and, and expenses for moving. So, yeah, it, it's actually, you know, a good idea. A lot of us here do that. Um, instead of spending money, they, we put it back in buckets, and we make it to where we can't get into the bucket unless we really, like, you know, after we have to cut open to, into the bucket just to get into it because we've glued it shut. <laughs> anyway, um, so, yeah, just as I said, if you pray, say a prayer for us that we find and get into a place very soon we really desperately need it especially now as hot as it is that window unit is not an expensive one it, it may not even last throughout the summer as far as I know anyway it's been very depressing to me um, very upsetting because uh, you know 
I have to move all that stuff around and then I have to worry about finding a place for it and then I have to worry about still finding a place to move and getting everything packed when I do and this process has taken a lot longer than it should but places here and as I said I'm I'm the house I'm running right now is the landlord doesn't fix the damn thing I, that's just I'm just gonna say it I'm not gonna mention his name or anything but I swear if I find anybody who's gonna try to rent that house from him I will tell them not to rent from him because he is, is a miserable landlord um, but that's what's happened I have not had luck renting so that's why right now I'm trying to go through the process of hopefully as I said within the next two months we'll have our own place that's you know I'm buying that I can call my own so yeah so that's where I'm at that's where things are at with me I just want to let you know I do apologize if you um, are waiting on friend mail as I said or, or anything else and I will start posting more videos I just I've <laughs> haven't had much luck with that this week this is like the fifth time I've been trying to make this video and every time I do someone interrupts me or comes in the door etc that being said before someone actually gets here to work I probably need to cut this off I have hub classes and everything today which means we have mandatory salon classes today and tomorrow and it's six hours of the day so all the stylists have to come and be in these classes including me I have to have these classes in the next day or two as it is so busy week um, tomorrow I'm actually supposed to get off at noon now whether or not that's gonna happen we'll see um, <laughs> you know how that goes especially with me um, I'm trying to think uh, it's hard for me to keep anything straight right now because there's so much going on but anyway thank you so much for sticking around thank you new subscribers I will have more project shares and videos coming up just this past week and a half has been so hectic and miserable for me my craft room is all set up at home in my bedroom so when I get home today which I have an appointment to talk with somebody about the new house and everything after work so by the time I get home and start on it, it may not be until 6 o'clock. So I may only get a few hours of crafting in today. But we'll see. And um, I, for everybody you know that wants to swap with me, I'm still in for that. And I will get with you within the next couple of days now that I have my room and everything set back up to where, you know, I can get to things. And depending on how fast I can get rolling with this house and if things go the way they are supposed to God willing and I'm praying then uh, you know maybe <laughs> you know even more hectic coming up because I'll have to get stuff moved we'll see about that I will keep you updated I will start doing some vlogs and they may be short ones but you know I'm gonna keep you update on to what's going on as where and my project shares you know they may be short but I will have them for you uh, thanks so much for watching have a great rest of the week keep that smile on your face you know it, it's not a bad life it's just a bad day and remember that as well as I have been doing pray for others be kind and you know I'll talk to you in the next video bye